Send me your submissions, I'll rate your gameplay. If you take a bison, you get F's all day. I really want to rate gameplay with you. Please like and subscribe for your boy. Subscribe for your boy. Yeah! Hello, friends, and welcome to episode 60 of Rate My Gameplay where we are going back to single episode runs. I had such a massive backlog of videos and I'm so thankful to everyone who submitted. Thank you. But in order to make it work, I had to do double episodes where we're doing two runs. We're going back to one now because we have Rakeem today. Then we have Giomba, then we have Josiah, then we have Kitty, and then we're back to square one and all the new submissions I can do instantly. Also, public service announcement. Andy Anonymous, if you are watching this, Andy Anonymous was meant to be a few episodes ago. I replied to your email, dude, but I don't know if you've seen it. I can't actually download your run. So Andy Anonymous, send them through again and I'll do them. Anyway, we come to today. Sorry, I had to clear those things up. Now we get to Rakim. Who, his name is Rakim Allah. I am 99.9% .9 sure he is a fellow Muslim. So assalamu alaikum, Rakim. Good to see you, brother. He's been a commenter for a long time and here's what he said. Hello, RevGT. Uh, it's nice to see proper grammar after the last episode. Hello, RevGT. Long time viewer, first submission. You'd like to see a comma in there, Rick? I'm, I'm joking. I've been grinding achievements in Custom Arena and was able to take a shot at one pet which has eluded me for a long time. This is not a perfect run, but it did have me on the edge of my seat. I hope you enjoy my brother, Rakeem. All right, I'm excited, dude. So Rakeem has sent it through this weird software Vidyard, I can't download it, but I, we can watch it here. It's a little bit on the clunky side, but who cares, dude? Who cares? We'll make it work. Back pill bug. It's loading. Okay, sorry. About I swear my internet's good. The, the mouse just hovering here is concerning. Anyway, Rakeem. You take the L on the first round. We're looking for tactics, creativity, dominance. You have an avatar. You are a sweat confirmed. Fish. Double fish. And the bluebird gets the memo. You love to see that. Okay, if you're someone that's like, oh, this quality isn't good enough. Just like suck an egg, dude. You, you'll survive. Rakeem, I got you, brother. We're watching your gameplay, man, and we're going to enjoy it. This is music. The, the, the mouse being there is really odd. I guess you're doing it to advance. It's all, it's all very perplexing. I wonder what the f what the achievement is. Is it a Robin? Rock and Robin. Tweet. Tweet. Rock and Robin. Also, like, you know what I like about you, Rakeem? This has been a, a source of debate for a long time between me and my I IRL friends. They are of the belief that you should not have underscores in your username. Whereas I... Personally, I think an underscore goes a long way. So I'm... I like that it's Rakeem underscore Allah underscore 777. It looks clean to me. Some people really dislike the idea of the... Uh, the underscores in a username. Let me know what you think. I'm curious to know what people think on that. Okay, so now the run starts to heat up a little bit, Rakeem. I can I, I pronounced your name right. I don't know how I said Rakim wrong, but I managed to. I was like Raccoon. Hoopo. So at first I was thinking maybe Robin's what you're looking for. But maybe Robin's not what you're looking for. In fact, it's definitely not what you're looking for considering you've sold it. This guy's team is not good. And yet. It's gonna cause you some issues. Hoopo goes crazy right there. No, you win. 
And and you you are winning regardless, I believe. I feel like I look very menacing when I swivel like this. No, that face isn't menacing. Wait, let me try again. Imagine you never met met me before. And you walk into a room and you say this. You'd be... You might not be intimidated. But you'd have your eye on me. And isn't that really what it's all about? I'm dribbling nonsense. Absolute nonsense. Are you going for a hoopo? Math? Bad. You lose. Is it hoopo? You got me on the edge of my swivel seat, bro. <laughs> you know what else I'd be curious about? I'm just thinking out loud at this point. The more the time goes on, the more I realize that so many people in the SAP community, English is not their first language, which makes it so impressive to me that like the language barrier doesn't become a problem. However, how many of my words can people not understand? Because the Australian accent, it's a confusing one, to say the least. Like, I think I pronounce my words more clearly than most Australians, but that's really not saying much. What is that noise outside? Is that music? Or a motor? Anyway. You turn down banana peel, you're a stronger man than I am. The hoopo's going crazy, the bluebird's going crazy. Is that your... Is that your pet? As this man's going frigate bird carry. And it almost worked. <coughs> In fact, it wasn't close, disregard what I just said. Rakim, you've got five? We're building slowly. Building me slowly with his run. Building me slowly with Hoopo. Oh, Nyala. Nyala's just a good pet, man. I know it, you know it. Now you beat Landrome here. A lot of kangaroos out today. Yeah, you win. Nyala, just absurdly strong. And then, you enter six wins, and I gotta be honest, me and the viewers, Rakim, don't really know what you're going for at this point. We can only assume it's Hoopo. But it could be Nyala, or it could just be a red herring. outside. Sorry, I'm just going to pan off screen for a sec. It's nothing. I'm hearing things. Hmm, loss. Did they snipe something at the back or did you have the Nyala at the back? Be curious to see. I recognize the name Suicidy Hobo. I feel like I've played against them a fair bit in Arena. No, you have the Nyala at the back. Oh, because you moved the better fish to the front. And are you going to one-up the Hoopo? You bet your sweet bibby you are. Okay, that's your achievement. Are you looking for Nyala? Oh, sorry. Um, uh, Wolverine? I haven't seen your pack, dude, so I'm not sure. But it has to be. Maybe you're looking for a little bit of seagull action. A little bit of Monica in my life. Hoopo's gonna do good things for you here. No other pet will have to attack. That's seven. You're on two health. The pressure builds, the pressure mounts. A little bit of Monica in my life. A little bit of Erica. Nyala makes total sense. It's just a solid build. I feel like uh, you probably had options for better scaling. But, you look at the teams you're versing. So that says guest. To me, that looks like a ghost team. You come back. You pop the coconut. You win convincingly. That rooster's level 2, I've just noticed. But it's not getting scaled. 
I keep feeling like I see someone outside. I'm not in my... I, this is like an away game for me. Oh, you're going for Chick! All right, second time in two episodes, I've been throwing a late curveball. It's Chick. It's Chick. Oh, Foreign threw me a curveball in episode 59. Rakeem, you've thrown all of us a curveball. And I was sitting there watching, like, yeah, Hoopo, that's kind of fun. Shouldn't be that hard to get an achievement for. You can get it really early. It's a, it's a perfectly fine pet. And now the math here is bad. And you're going to lose this. It was just a bad matchup for you, you know? Kind of close. Now you're on one health. And now you are on the edge of your seat, as you proclaimed. Now we can all be fairly confident you're getting to 10 wins. Level on the Spino? Yeah, yeah, I see it. It's really been a bluebird's delight, this game. Let's see how you go. You sort of need a fortunate matchup with this kind of team. It's a Snipes, but you've got one-ups. Yeah, dude. Great unit to be hit by the Leopard. And, oh, dude, it's beautiful to see. Might kill a couple of things, doesn't even matter. Okay, you must have been sweating. And that is, oh, God, okay. Uh, I like that the, the rooster was there, and I was like, wait, but what is it? Why? why? And then it was like, oh, that's why, you know? And uh, I explained that really well, I'm confident. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Rakeem, let's bring it home. Scaling! Bang. Okay, the it's actually incredible value here. Oh, my God. Oh, the Spino got you enough to stay alive. Oh, my God, Spino. That's clutch, clutch, clutch Spino. Wait, there we go. Let's pause it there. Yo, the Spino giving just enough stats. Let's actually go back and watch that. That was so cool. Is the quality better now all of a sudden? No. So as of right now, this Bison is killing your chick in one hit. And the Kangaroo will be pretty nasty. Although, wait. Let's see what the Kangaroo gets to. So you get just enough. Let's imagine the Bison killed here and traded. Oh, you were winning anyway. But still, it's cool to see the Spino go crazy like that. Rakeem, fun run, man. Again, second time in two episodes. Actually, the second time in two episodes I've had this type of screenshot as well. But second time in two episodes that I have been, like, uh, bamboozled right towards the end. And I respect it and I enjoy it. And Rakeem, let's write. Tactics. I do feel like you could have gone a different direction for scaling than the giraffe. Like moving to monkey or something would have done a lot more for you. But that said, considering you wanted the chick and you managed to use your gold, and you actually had a hoopo bird do some carrying, like, I would say like B+. Creativity, I don't even have the chick achievement. And by that measure, <laughs> A+. Dominance. Crept over the line, but it was a strong team at the end. Let's go a B. And I'm just going to settle that at A-. Rakeem, I enjoyed that run heaps, man. That was sick. I hope everyone enjoyed it too. I like that these submissions are like, you think you know what's coming, and then boom, all of us are like, wait, wait did he just do that? That's everyone's natural reaction, right? To start talking like an idiot and say, did he just do that? Okay, anyway, I so I feel like my sign-off should have been better, but I'll never re-record a single thing in my life. Rakeem, thank you so much. Welcome to the Rate My Gameplay Brethren, officially. I hope everyone enjoyed it, and you should get your seatbelts on, because Giomba is coming in episode 61. Have a great day, and I'm out of here. Peace.